All right, welcome to Metroid. This is the all bosses category, so I'll be fighting both Kraid and Ridley. I'm doing the faster but more dangerous Kraid first route, so uh, this will be a lot of fun. Let's go. Actually, let's uh, let's power off, power on, and we will do it. So it's when I press start, so I'll just give you a countdown. All right, three, two, one, go. So first we have to go get this Morphal, and this lets Samus, the main character, uh, morph into a ball, like that. Um, one of the crazy things about Metroid is I use eight different grips throughout the run, so we're already on to grip number four. I used three in the first room. And these are door wraps, so I'm just repeatedly pressing down and up to morph Samus into a ball and then unmorph out of the ball. So good clean wrap there. And we will enter Kraid's lair. So this next wrap that I'm gonna do has some off-screen movement, so it's not just a straight up and down. Just gotta drop down here, a little left, right, left. And then I'm gonna wrap this till it can't wrap anymore. Tap left, full jump, and then wrap some more. And I'm just a little misaligned. Do we have a second controller? We forgot that. <laughs> I need to up an A. I saw flocked. <laughs> I can't believe I pressed down. Now it's a co-op. Huh? <laughs> we actually needed the second controller anyway. Shout out to Stuck in a Blade. Save. There we go. <laughs> All right. So we'll do that without soft locking this time. And we've got the bad crate pattern. <laughs> so I'm going to up A one more time. That's what happens in attempts. Exactly. If we keep getting the bad crate pattern, I'll make it two crate and then we'll swap out to a safe state. Should be good. So this wrap has a lot of off-screen movement. Hold right, jump over to the left. I'm gonna do a safety strat here. Normally we would shoot the door open, but now I'm gonna shoot it open. And then I wrap up. This is a slow but safe strat. You could do what's called a delayed unmorph where you morph into the ball, wait for a little bit and then unmorph. But the reason it's risky is because if you unmorph too late, you'll soft lock. So this is the safety strat. And I'm doing a little safety strat here as well. And everybody say hi to Craig. Alright, that was the bad banana. So I'm going to load a save state. And we will beat Craig. And then beat the rest of the game. I should press the power button. Uh, oops. I can't even navigate the power pack. There it is. Thank <laughs> you. 
Alright, everybody say bye to Craig. So now we're going to death warp up in A, like uh, Zelda 1, and make our way over to fight Ridley. So one of the cool things about Metroid is if you hold the fire button, uh, which is B, and then you press any other button, you'll get, every time you press a button, you'll fire another shot. So that's what I was doing with Kraid. I'm using another grip there to hold B. And then I mash the select button. Select is normally used to toggle between your weapons. So now I have missiles, as you'll see right there. But uh, when you only have your basic weapon, select doesn't do anything. So we use that to mash to fight Kraid with. on that guy so I can have some more room on this jump right there and now we are climbing the blue column I gotta wait a little bit there for the ripper to go the other direction so that this ripper doesn't get in my way so enemies are are linked in their slots and if one enemy leaves the screen moving a certain direction another enemy in that same slot will move the same direction so we have to do uh, a little bit of en enemy manipulation in this run, which you'll see in a few different spots, and I'll explain those. Easiest room in the game right there. So, Metroid McFly holds the world record in this category, a 1349. He uses a route that does not get ice. We're getting ice right now because it's a lot easier. Uh, I have third place in this, which is a 1436, but I do use ice. Ice list will save at least half a minute. Or about half a minute. So we're wrapping to go get the ice beam. That damage boost is actually fine. It reduced the lag there. And then these bugs spawn in random patterns. You want to shoot at least two of them to reduce the lag. So I got kind of an unfortunate pattern there. And now we get the ice beam. In the any percent run, you would death warp all the way back to the beginning. But we're doing all bosses, so now we got to go fight Ridley. Take a damage boost here. So in Metroid, um, if you jump, Samus will move at 75% of the speed as if she's running on the ground. So that's why I took that damage boost. So there's another fun wrap. That one is pretty easy to soft lock on as well. So I had to be pretty careful there. Now we're entering Norfair. This is my favorite music right here. Got the good Ridley pattern. That purple guy, if he hops all the way to the ceiling, then he's it's a bad Ridley pattern. Anything else is a good Ridley pattern. So we like good Ridley pattern. And now I'm gonna do the last wrap of the run right here. So last chance for a major soft lock, but it's gonna it's the easy easy wrap. I'm also doing a strategy to set up a spawn at the end of this room to reduce the lag in the next room. So this is a strategy I discovered. If you don't roll out of, in, of that wall in a ball, then this guy will be at the bottom of the screen. Oh, he wasn't there. So unfortunately, we're going to get lag. It works like 80% of the time. 
but we didn't get to have it working this time, so we'll just have to have some lag. Take the bottom route. Not getting any health drops. <laughs> We're living dangerously here. So I'm gonna get 30 health here. Pick up a little health. I lost four seconds. <laughs> but that'll change my Ridley pattern. Now it's random, so I don't know what it'll be. So I'm doing a lag reduction strategy here, which I missed. Want some help. The drops are being unfavorable. Also not favorable. Also not favorable. This is not so fun. One more. There we go. Oh, I'm on the wrong door. <laughs> I never have to farm here, so I... It's all going wrong. Yo, is this guy gonna, like, come back? I guess not. <laughs> That actually might be better anyway. We'll, we'll get back there. Whoops. All right, different pattern this time. That's my least favorite room in the whole run, by the way. So. It's fun when you do it right, though. And that's why I needed help, because I have to take that hit. One of the tightest jumps in the game right there. There aren't many tight jumps. Uh, we got the bad Ridley pattern now, because I had to do the up and A's. So we'll get two early shots in.
There we go. All right, Ridley's dead. So now more death warps back to the beginning of the game. And then we'll climb the blue column again up to Torian. Torian is where Mother Brain is hiding. So I'm going to grab an extra E-Tank that I don't grab in the speed run just for some health for fighting Mother Brain, because Mother Brain room can be quite the beast, as you'll see. So we're going to roll over here, get this guy to go off screen, come here, and get our safety. So now we don't have to worry about health at all for the most part. That's the laggiest spot right there. So this room has the other tight jump in the game. But I use the uh, Sunwest B to A swipe. Right there. And I missed it. <laughs> so this bridge we have to spawn by killing or by shooting both statues in the any percent run there's a trick where you can lure uh, the big bug which is called a Rio in there and you can freeze it with the ice and skip the bridge so that's the any percent strategy just gonna farm for missiles here take as many opportunities we can get at least we're full on health now yeah, you need a minimum of 73 for Mother Brain. Uh, in any percent, you can only get up to 75, so you have to be near perfect in the any percent run. I guess that rink of freeze and then jump is one of the other tight spots in this run. Zigzag room. Perfect zigzag room. Yo, we got missiles. I'm gonna pick up one more health. Yeah, don't let a Metroid hug you. We don't like hugging Metroids. All missiles. Exactly. Alright, now we fight Mother Brain. Intentional damage boost there.
fused on my butt. We're alright. Play it safe. And I have to feature the Dan's Wallet shirt because if you fall in the lava there at the end, you cannot. Uh, I'll call time when we press up on the elevator at the top here. So I'm going to do the fast climb. That's Metroid, man. Yeah, that just happens. That is, uh, <laughs> 